December 11th, 2021. This is the day that we have been looking for. Forward to, this is our answered prayer. Uh, I recall seven years back when my love asked me to be his girlfriend in church. And today we are getting married in the same church. So I bless God, this is a beautiful day and I'm looking forward to become Mrs. Victor. Today is a very special day for me because uh, I'm going to get married to the person I love the most. And uh, a short story about uh, this uh, particular person. Her name is Joanne Wangoi Deuri. We met at uh, Nairobi Calvary Temple during a mentorship course back then, uh, let's say around six years ago. And um, what I did love uh, about her the most is uh, First of all, definitely have to talk about her beauty, she's beautiful. Uh, and uh, the other side of it is uh, she has a clean heart. She's, um, she's hardworking, she's patient, she's understanding. And uh, among very many attributes that I can give for her. It was way back in 2014. And we were just sharing about our future together and I just had a certain gown in mind, which exactly this is what I got. I never knew they would ever exist. So as I count my answered prayers, my dream gown is one of them. Leave my thoughts on the table. Set my keys by the door. No, it's not been easy, but Mungu ni nani? At the end of the day, today is the day that God has given unto us, and you shall celebrate it. Amen. And now when you get into marriage, I would advise you that you put away all evil noises that are going to come your way. Whether between you or if it is on Victor, I pray that the Lord may be the pillar and that you will be able to listen to his voice and not any other. Leave my thoughts on the table. Set my keys by the door oh. All these fortune and fame I don't think they need us no more In my head like a blitzkrieg On my heart like a war This one ain't mine anymore like an angel in white on the way can you be like a drone straight from a song that i've known all along victor kangila will you take joan wangoi to be your love wedded wife to have and to hold from this day forward for better or for worse for richer or poorer in sickness and in health to love and to cherish as long as you both shall live yes i do yes i do hey give them another good hand. to you my love victor it has been seven years since you asked me to be your girlfriend the most beautiful part is you asked me to be your girlfriend in this church and we committed it to god and for sure, they have been my most amazing years of my life. I recall before accepting, I was too hesitant because I never believed in love. But since the beginning of this, you have shown me what being a princess feels like and what a queen feels like owning an empire and the most handsome king. You are my most special gift and just from the beginning, I still ask the same God that you committed this relationship to. And the same God that our parents raised us to serve. That I shall be committed to this relationship. That our God will be glorified in this marriage. And that I will love you. I will submit to you. Hold on to you no matter the circumstances. Honor you and build our family by making you the proudest dad and the husband by raising our children in a way that our parents have praised us on the same altar 
And just as our names, may our love be filled with joy and victory in Jesus' name. And this is my sermon vow to you, Victor. News, CNN, news breaking. Today is when? 11th. When? December. The year of our Lord, 2021. I present to you the newest couple in the city of Nairobi, Mr. and Mrs. Kangira. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. I pressed I am. pulling apart the waves as I fall into your arms. Tearing up roses as daylight approaches, just hoping to be what you want. Hold me up with your bare hands. On this road that you wander, burning like some bottle rock. Let me fight for your honor, raise a wall for your truth, build it up like a fortress, wave the flag when I come.
can breathe.